Y'all, what's up, y'all? Y'all already know who it is. Your girl, Versailles. She is Choco Blue Experience. And yes, I'm Kari's mother, Alva. And I'm back with another video, another word. Um, So, y'all, before I even get started, like, I really talked to God before I recorded this video. And, like, Lord, do you want me to record this word? Do you want me to record this motivational speech? Because, literally, like, I just remember, like, and this is, this wasn't even part of it, but it's been, like, in my spirit all day. And, like, I just remember, like, when I was going to Job Corps a while back, a few years ago, like, I would always watch this dude, and he was a motivational speaker um, on YouTube. And so, here I am. Like, I always said I wanted to be a motivational speaker, and I am she, okay? I'm her. But uh, I'm going to get straight into the word. So, I just want to thank you. Um, I allow the Holy Spirit to come in. Heavenly Father, we thank you for everything you do. Keep us covered, Lord. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So look, right. God told me to say, <laughs> this not just for me, right? He said that, look at the type of day that you had. Look how I still made everything doable. He said that even though you went through what you went through all in one day, all within not even the 24 hours yet, look how you're still able to encourage others. Look how you're still able to uplift others. Like in the midst of the storm, you're still able to help give to others. You're still able to help pull up others. So y'all got to remember, right? There is a lot of things in this word that we tell ourselves that we want or our flesh try to make us believe that we want and that we solely desire to have and need, right? But if you really, really think about it, right? And I'm going through this now. If you really, really think about it, you don't need it. It's only until after you get it that you find out that you truly did not need it. So I want y'all to know that just keep going, just keep trucking, just keep believing in God, keep standing on that big faith because nothing is worth your freedom. Do not give up. Do do not tell yourself that if I just get a little bit of this or that, or if I just do a little bit of this or that, that I'm going to be okay afterwards. Like, no, I'm telling you, literally, <laughs> you're going to regret it. You're going to be in big repentance mode and you're going to really, really see and understand that in the midst of it all, God still hasn't changed. In the midst of it all, God is still right there. He's literally all up in your grill. So do not let anything take your freedom away. Do not let anything have you feeling like because it's just the spirit of the moment and you feeling the urge. Don't. Okay. I promise y'all it's really not worth it. And even just me recording this word right now and speaking to y'all on this on this subject and in this position, like God is great. God is so amazing. He's so awesome, right? Because the devil thought that he had me and he won't. I love you all in Christ. I hope y'all have a beautiful day. Peace.